so what are the chances that it's 6 40 a.m in the middle of nowhere on the side of a mountain i literally get caught with my pants down by like an 80 year old man the sun's not even up and i've already got caught with my pants down <laughs> great start to the day what a sneaky one of you. Where'd he come from? Where'd he come from? There's nothing for miles that way. What did I do? So, as challenging as this little boot tying session has been, uh, and everything in life is about perspective. So, every time I struggle now, it takes me a little longer than most to tie my shoes. I just think back to when it took me eight months to learn how to put my socks on again after getting injured. It's cold, had about a 4 a.m. wake up, but glad to be here, pumped for another day, uh, another adventure, but um, I guess I'll see you at the top. I will climb the highest mountains and I'll swim every river, every sea. The one and only time I've ever done this trail uh, and hike before, we saw some interesting guests <laughs> along the way. I guess because at the top of this mountain there's a huge clearing and a pasture, uh, I guess the cows feel it's worth it to climb this mountain in order to get up there. So <laughs> hopefully we do. but. If you see a massive dark object in the trail, it's probably not a bear, it's probably just a cow uh, sitting there staring at you. So we're about to reach the top of the mountain, 5,200 feet roughly. Last time I came and the only other time I've hiked this, When I got to the top, it was extremely foggy. So today, hopefully with the nice weather, we'll be able to see all the way to South Carolina. Oh. We'll climb the highest mountains and this is covered in grass. How does that every river, every sea. Oh yeah. I knew they'd be up here just to eating. Oh, Betsy, my girl was up here trying to hide from me. <laughs> oh, Betsy. <laughs> oh, there she is. <laughs> there she is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, I cannot make this up. I came here like two or three weeks ago. Made friends with uh, old Betsy over here. Come back almost a month later and she's still sitting in the exact same spot eating. That's amazing. <laughs> The old 8 a.m. stare down. <laughs> I mean, what a breakfast spot. <sighs> She's a big one. Hey. 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 Uh, 
Just gonna check out the other. <laughs> Excuse me. There's some farmer hiding out here getting me on influencers in the wild. I'm gonna be upset. <laughs> We're at the top of Bear Wallow Mountain, roughly 5,200 feet elevation. It's about 30 degrees colder than it was when I left the city this morning, but uh, that's what you get for being on top of a mountain. Yes, it's cold. Yes, we're out here braving the elements. Yes, it's early. No, I did not want to get up at 3.30 this morning and make a two and a half hour drive here. Uh, but sometimes in life, you have to uh, work to those beautiful accomplishments and uh, experiences. So we owe it to ourselves to use this precious time that we have to simply make the most of it. You owe it to yourself to live a life worth living and go out and have those experiences. Live your life so that when you get to those final few seconds, you don't ask for more time and you don't want more time. Just kidding. Oh, this water is so clear. Oh. Perfect. Dropped a plastic bag accidentally on an accidental litter. Yeah. 
you take this right now. You take it before it defeats me yet again. Oh, don't mind me. Just make them lemonade out of lemons. I'm soaking wet. I'm really cold. I'm bruised and scraped up but it was worth it so get out there and have an adventure it's 7 40 a.m and we are in the middle of the street oh this is a nice shot <laughs> now the tables have turned look who's on camera now <laughs> 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 Get him out of here, Drew! Get him out of here!